guys welcome back to my channel we are getting in to the halloween season so uh i am quite sick so if you guys notice my nasally voice just excuse me but let's get started with this tutorial so i'm gonna start off creating this half skull and i'm gonna just make the outline of my skull so i'm leaving a little bit of space for my noses because you'll see we're gonna create some cool detail there in a bit and we want this to cover the full bottom half of your face and surprisingly you know this is actually not that hard to create um, I chose to use some face paint from a company called Mayron they make a lot of special effects stuff so if you're looking to do that this Halloween season hit Mayron up they've got some amazing stuff so again here you know I'm just going in and really making sure that I get that detail on the outline and then I'm just gonna fill it in so I used about two coats of the white paint so the first part I used just my foundation brush to just get a nice base and um, then you know here I am just making that detail like that slight indent for the nose and then covering the sides of my nose because you don't want any part of your skin peeking out also a side note I put on concealer before this and you can see that I fixed it later <laughs> but don't put any concealer before you put on your face paint lesson learned <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going in with a beauty sponge to get that like nice airbrushed look, you know, and I mean, hello, of course, if you have darker skin, you're not going to get it completely white, but you know what, you're going to get it close enough. All right, so now I'm going in with some black paint detail on my nose and you know like when you looked at a skull basically the middle of the nose is missing that's what we're aiming for right here so um, you know I found that I had to go over this a few times so that it wouldn't have that like off black color because of the white paint but it worked out and I also kind of painted you know uh, like almost a little bit like inside my nostril so that my skin wouldn't appear <laughs> if that makes sense um also you'll notice i also sponged where my lips are white so uh yeah you know because that's where we're gonna put the detail of the teeth later all right, so now it's time to draw, um, I don't know what that bone is, but you know, at the edge where it like connects to your, your teeth. Um, so I'm just shading that in. I'm kind of freehanding this, so I wasn't quite sure. I just kind of drew it and came back to it later. But basically color that in all black. And then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get started with the teeth. So the teeth, they are not hard to do, but they were pretty time consuming. So you wanna draw a line from your mouth all the way to connect where that bone is, that black bone. And then I was kind of drawing in where like the cheek indents would be and then drawing in some vertical lines and that's where we're gonna have the teeth be. So we're gonna shade in between to create the effect of, you know, teeth being there. <laughs> You'll see in a second. So also you guys, I think you should give me a thumbs up for this video because this is my first time ever doing face paint. I practiced once, but I've never done a tutorial and I'm just so impressed. <laughs> it wasn't that hard actually. So now I'm putting black on the inside of my lips um, just because, you know, I want to give the appearance when my lips are closed that, you know, it's uh, 
you can't see any skin. And I'm also creating an outline right underneath my eyes and creating cracks from where my chin is. And now I'm going in with some black eyeshadow and I'm doing some shading around that cheek. And I'm also kind of creating some more indents and shadowing it and really just blending. This look is super easy. There's just a lot of blending that needs to be done. And now I'm also going ahead and I'm shading right underneath that eye to kind of create a nice shadow. I really want it to look like, you know, I've got the sunken in eye sockets. And now I finally am starting on the teeth. So um, I'm just creating like a Hershey's Kiss kind of shape, <laughs> if that makes sense. And I'm using just like a regular uh, lip brush and then also the eyeshadow part to do some blending towards the vertical lines. This is the final look. I'm super proud of it. I will be putting up a tutorial every week for October, Halloween month. So make sure you stay tuned and subscribe if you're not already. Bye.